Hi, cuties. Hey, YouTube friends. Sorry it's been a while. We have kid videos, but they're just unedited. So I finally had the time to quickly edit up my videos and put them together um, to show you all the videos of the newborn goat kids. We had baby goats in April. So yes, it's been a few months, um, but I'll quickly catch you guys up to speed and show you all of my um, baby goat kids when they were born and what the first week was like. And then I'll do a farm update here in just a little bit to kind of show you where we are now in the height of the summer and how the kids are growing and all that fun stuff. Just uh, life and busyness. So here goes, sorry about the delay. Well, today I came home from work and both of my moms decided to have kids on the same day. Ethel here kitted around noon and Lucy kitted around seven and since they were so close in birth I think Ethel was trying to take care of all four kids so we decided to separate her from her sister so if you can see back there in our other our other little pasture there's Lucy and she's got her two babies out there. Yeah, and she had hers at like seven. So a boy and a girl for Lucy. And then Ethel, she's got two little boys. All right, well, here's Lucy and her kitties. Funny how last year's babies were redheads, this year babies. They're all white. The buckling is standing and the little doling is laying under her mom. There's Lucy and her babies. Hey Lucy. Come on. The new baby already adopted his half sister, I think. They were headbutting each other a second ago. Come on, go get him. Big tough boy's already ready to play. Two snuggly warm babies. These are both of Ethel's boys. Cuties. Hi, cuties.
like this one's starting to figure out there's a little house. Get in there, it'll be warm. A nice warm day. Babies are stretching their legs and playing. So this guy had some curled front tendons. So it's kind of a strength issue. We just put on little braces to see if he'll straighten up. The big black shadow is meeting his new friends. He's your protector, guys. He keeps the coyotes away. These guys are only two days old at this point, so they're still working on Finding their strength in their legs, they're still a little jelly, but they get a little bit of selenium after they're born, and that definitely helps build up that strength. So then after two days, we decided to let the mamas back in with each other and see how they did with each other's kids and with the whole group, because I'd really rather them all be together so they can all bond together. She had her one little one follow her out here. It's freaking adorable. He's coming, he's coming. Here's the goat reunion. She's like, I think these are mine too. I think the mamas are like, wait, who's who? Hi, little girl. Hi. <laughs> Run away. Oh, and Ethel's other baby that she left. He's all the way over there. He decided that he's going to join the party. All right. So this one with the braces is Ethel's actual kid that's out here. We'll see if we can tell them apart. We might have to ear tag them early. Is that your kind of baby? Oh, Trevor rescued him. Now we gotta make sure we don't get him confused with Lucy's oldest. Other than Lucy's oldest is really dirty right now. She wait, who's who? Who's who? That one's yours. I think she's... Yeah, I think she's a little confused. They're with the right moms right now. Yeah. Oh, never mind. That one's that one's Lucy's. And that one, the one, Ethel's is trying to drink from Lucy's right now. Oh my gosh! There's just so many babies. We'll see how it goes for a little bit, and if if it looks like there's going to be too much chaos, we'll just put 
put them back. Well, the merger went pretty successful. Except for, I like how Astrid, which is Lucy's last year's daughter, this one, I like how she treats the babies way better than Ethel's two daughters. I watched one get headbutted by one of those guys, which I wasn't a fan of, so we'll have to keep an eye on that. But we put little blue strings around Ethel's boys so we can just visually see who's who. Makes it easier on us. And there's Angus, of course, always watching. Always watching his babies. Oh, I was trying to get crazy, crazy little boy but goat. Oh, there he goes. Doing some crazy jumps. This is day three. Baby goats are doing really good. And everybody's enjoying the sunshine. Yeah. How are your kids? These ones are kind of being lazy lumps. These ones are lazy lumps. Yeah, they're being lazy lumps. It's a nice warm day. They're sunning themselves. When we got... We made these guys, this little guy's braces a little bit taller. Seem to be working really well. He's nice and stable. We'll probably take him off in like a day, maybe two. But he's looking really good. Hopefully we'll strength out, strengthen out his tendons there. He's my favorite. Because since we had to pick him up a lot, he's cuddly. Too cuddly. They're still favoring one side of Ethel, which, I don't know, she's not really a dairy goat, so I guess it doesn't really matter, but. <laughs> so you can see this side, it's very big compared to the other side. A little lopsided. Oh well. All the babies. They're all cuddled in. That's what that's for, huh guys? That we all snuggly and warm. All snuggly and warm? Yeah? So today the babies are six days old. And we're going to go ahead and take off the temporary leg braces on Ethel's youngest boy and see how his legs have improved. Hi, little cutie. So these bands have been working really good. His legs are nice and strong, I think. At least he's walking really good on them. So I'm going to take them off and we're going to see how he does. All right, got them off by myself. So let's set this little guy down and see how he does. Look how good your legs are now. Aren't they so good? Other than the hair being a little bit smashed, you would never know. Look at you! You're so strong all of a sudden!
Are you so strong? You're so strong? Look at you being a big strong boy. Look at you being a big strong boy. Yeah. You're a big strong boy now. Those tendons, they just needed a little bit of help, huh? This one's my favorite, unfortunately. It's a boy, though. We can't have a boy goat. We have to have girl goats. We have to have girl goats. Huh. We're gonna have some girl goats. You are just so precious. I love you lots. Well, it was a success. Your legs are stronger now. Huh. Your legs are stronger now. Let's see your brother. Hello, buddy. What are you doing? And your legs are strong, too. You have a little bit of a weakness on the back leg, but this one's always strengthened out after a couple days. Here he goes. Like nothing ever happened. Dang, I love these kids. So cute. All straightened out, huh? Hope everyone enjoyed seeing the kid update. And stay tuned for my next video on our farm update.